A longtime city of North Charleston employee says Mayor Keith Summey made sexual advances toward her for decades before and during her tenure with the city. She says that now she's finally coming forward and ready to tell her story. News News' Katie Augustine spoke one-on-one -on -one with Delissa Reynolds, and Katie Reynolds says she didn't come forward earlier because of fear of retaliation. Brendan Carolyn, yes, Reynolds says she planned on leaving the city once Mayor Summey's current term ended, but other circumstances caused her job to become unstable, and she says that's when she fell under a higher level of scrutiny. Allegations years in the making against North Charleston Mayor Keith Summey. How many times? I can't tell you. I can't tell you that. I don't, I, it was so many. Delisa Reynolds has worked for the city of North Charleston since 2001, but before that, she and her husband at the time were close friends of Keith Summey and his wife Debbie. The couples owned a business together, a post office on East Montague Avenue. Reynolds says it was there that the first incident happened. I was in the post office working, and he came in, and I went into the closet, and he followed me. And that's where it all began. It was groping, um, kissing me. That was in 1999. But Reynolds says the advances continued even after she began working at the city of North Charleston. It progressed. She never reported the alleged harassment out of fear of retaliation. Now, 23 years later, she's speaking up. So, why now? Because they have taken everything. They have jeopardized my family. They've taken my job, what my passion was. She tells me things started to take a turn last October. Her adult son made a negative comment on social media about Elliot Summy, the mayor's son. Soon after, Reynolds says she was moved to another job within the city, and she says she was scrutinized and micromanaged while no one else was because of her son's actions. They were forcing me out of a position and creating a position that I technically do not have the knowledge to do. The city released a statement denying any allegations of inappropriate sexual conduct by Mayor Summey and says the job transition did not negatively impact her pay or benefits. Reynolds says she originally planned to leave quietly when the mayor's term ends, but changed her way of thinking. I started rethinking this was not the life that I wanted to live. Reynolds is currently on leave from her position as part of the Family and Medical Leave Act due to medical issues. In studio, I'm Katie Augustine. Count on two.